The big pets. The big pets by Lane Smith. The girl was small and the cat was big. And on certain nights, she rode on his back to the place where the milk pool was. While he drank, she swam and she came out smelling like fresh milk. So did the other night children who gathered there. The big cat would lick off the extra, then he and the girl walked about, drying her hair in the warm night breeze. Sometimes they saw the small boy who rode on the back of the big dog, and they waved as he headed for the bone gardens. There he played while his dog gnawed. Together they dug up old bones with other kids who came with their dogs. A mile away at the grassy plains, a dozen kids, sometimes more, rolled and tumbled with their pet snakes. And little beyond that, children played at the hamster holes. And at Cricket Creek, one little boy sat with his pet. The cat and the girl often wondered what fun there was in that, especially when one could easily wish for a milk pool. Or a scratching forest. Or a place where the stringy vines teased. And if one were truly lucky, perhaps even an entire Milky Way. The girl was small and the cat was big. And their nights always ended in the sleeping basket that was just big enough for the both of them.